Day three, we are going to go through a valley that takes us to the town of Kabushing. So join us for that. So this is day three of all the exploring we've been doing around Goreme and Cappadocia. We try to explore as much as we can on our free time when we're not working. Today we actually finished work at around four, so we wanted to go for a bit of an easier hike. The other two days were quite intense, so today we thought we would just go for a shorter hike around Goreme. So basically what we want to do today is just a loop around this valley and come back into Goreme. This hike is pretty easy, it's mostly flat, and it's a great option for someone that doesn't want to do a hike as intense as we did the other two days. So where we are now is just a 10 or 15 minute walk from central Goreme and it's just a really easy hike that you can do in a short amount of time with a pretty big payoff as everything else here in the Cappadocia region. Well, our main objective for the end of this hike is to make it to the viewpoint number five, which is just in this direction. So we're actually using the Maps.me app. So we were pretty freaking beat up after day one and two. We needed about two days to recover from that. But today we we're finally ready for another adventure. So just after work, this was the perfect spot to come and chill out. Only took us about half an hour to get where we are now. And it's just so peaceful and lovely. And the next day will be our last free day of adventure. So let's see what kind of stuff awaits us on that day. See you then. Good morning and welcome to day four of our hikes all around Cappadocia. Today the mission is to go to Rose Valley. Seems it's called Rose Valley because of all the coloring of the rocks. They're red and rosy. It's supposed to be really beautiful. So we're gonna go check it out. We're going kind of in that direction. We're gonna have a look through the valley and we're gonna see what we do from there. There's a possibility of rain today, but we will move forward regardless. Let's do this. We're going in that general direction. You can see all the ATV tours heading that way. We've decided to walk as usual. And yeah, we've had some time to recover since day three of hiking and it was well needed because we were pretty pooped. But now we're ready to check out all the valleys on our last day of Cappadocia. We were walking up here and we finally caught up with the ATV people. We can see it's like the start of Rose Valley here and everyone's walking up here. So it seems important. So we're gonna go see what happens up there. So we're here now at the top of this hill and you can actually see Uchisar right behind me. We were up on the top of that rock way back there. That was on day two of our hike. And look where we are now in the middle of Rose Valley. Cappadocia is just endless beauty. Everywhere you look, you could spend a lifetime here and still not see everything. This has an arrow for Rose, but I do want to see what's this way. Okay, so for the next part of this journey, we could go into Rose Valley and follow this path here all the way to Red Valley, but we want a little more of a challenge. So we're gonna continue on our little ridge walk through here. The sights must be pretty amazing as well. We are headed in that general direction for Red Valley. <laughs> see you there. We did see arrows saying like this way to Red Valley and Rose Valley, but honestly, you don't really need trail markers because no matter where you go, it's gonna be amazing. Like we chose to walk up here. And honestly, I think that this is cooler than just walking on the path down in the valley. So there's tons of trails around and it seems like you can just kind of go off and do your own thing. And I mean, in Cappadocia, everything you see is gonna be amazing. So you won't be disappointed. Go 
always get me in my worst moments. <laughs> yeah, it's revenge. <laughs> We're quickly approaching Red Valley now and we've arrived at a cave. Seems you have to go through it to get to the other side. And then supposedly we will be in Red Valley. So let's go see what happens in there. This is my favorite hike so far. I think I say that every day. But honestly, every day feels really exciting, like my new favorite. Love how like in nature we are the whole time. And these caves are so cool. It reminds me of Utah or something. This hike just keeps getting more and more adventurous. Definitely didn't expect to run into this here. It seems that you go up these stairs and through a tunnel that's like 86 meters. So <laughs> let's do it. Trying to survive out here. <sighs> oh yeah. Church and on the way we meet a new friend Alona Hello. from Russia. <laughs> What's cool about this hike is that you just run into these random churches and this one is called the Column Churches for obvious reason. Like look at the structure that you just find in the middle of nowhere here in Cappadocia. We're going to see some other ones on the way to Chabushin. So Chaboshin is about 3,336 meters away. But lucky for us, there's this cafe right here. And we're so thirsty and so hungry. So we're gonna stop. What's your name, my friend? My name is Amy. It's a beautiful spot. Thank you. Beautiful much. area. We are cave people, cave <laughs> Yeah, that's right. So here we are at the cafe. It's just by a church. It has some amazing frescoes in there. And we've had some like orange, grapefruit, pomegranate energy bombs. And also now we're having some hot wine because it just felt right. It's a bit chilly out and some hot wine will help us get through the rest of the trail. All right, so we made it to the town of Chabushin, but we are super tired and we did not have enough strength to go up through the churches and stuff because we haven't had lunch. So we're gonna try to hitchhike here on this road now. Let's see how long it takes for someone to pick us up. <laughs> <laughs> We tried hitchhiking for like two minutes, didn't work out. A bus stopped for us. It's kind of like a, it's an intercity bus. We don't know how much it is. Uh, it's going along for the ride. Got to try to pay him on the way out. We'll be in Goreme soon. Wow, what an adventure that was. It was the perfect end to our time here in Cappadocia. A full day just hiking around Rose Valley, Red Valley, eventually making our way into Chabushin and catching the bus back here to Gorem. We're going to be traveling around this country for another two months or so. So if you want to check out everything we get up to in Turkey, just click on this playlist that's on your screen and we'll see each other over there. Three, two, one. <laughs>